Hi, I'm back. And this time I'm going to give you three bathing suit looks for the mature woman. Hold on one moment while I stand up and show you this gorgeous beauty that I'm wearing now. Hold on. What do you think? It's a one piece. You can see that I do not have the perfect body. I'm thick across the middle. I have a gut. Here we go in the back. I do not have a perfect ass. My thighs are larger. And as I said, my waist, my waist could be smaller, but this swimsuit is flattering as all get out. Hold on, I'm taking my hat off, ladies. This bathing suit has a story and I'm going to tell you the story. My daughter, Una, had her bachelorette weekend last week. Um, she and her bridal party spent the weekend in Austin, Texas, and she had this bathing suit on, but she had it in white. Like, uh, please, I would never wear a white bathing suit because you saw the movie Jaws about the great white. I don't need to be harpooned, okay? But anyway, my petite daughter had this in white. And being a mom, my first reaction was, Holy shit, how much did she spend for that bathing suit? She had to spend like over a hundred bucks. Is she nuts? But with that reaction was, my baby girl looks great. She looks great. She's the best looking bride to be I've ever seen. So when I was talking to her, I mentioned, I was like, hey, Una, um, that bathing suit is really gorgeous. Uh, how much money did that set you back? And then she went in for the kill. She told me that she got it on Amazon. I almost dropped dead. So naturally, as soon as we got off the phone, I went over to Amazon. I went to my Amazon storefront and added this bathing suit in one of my ideal lists, which I will put the link to um, before I go any further, I just want to let you know, because I'm transparent, if you do decide to get any of the bathing suits that I am showcasing, and if you order them through Amazon, through my storefront, I will receive a commission. So um, if you don't mind my getting a commission, it would be really great if you um, purchase them through my Amazon store. If not, that's cool. I'm spreading the news about the suit. Um, already, two of my friends already purchased the suit. I purchased this suit literally moments after I got off the phone with Una. Um, let me tell you what I love about this. I love, I love the way the top is because it's modest, but it's not frumpy looking. Now, this waistband in between the black stripes is a mesh fabric so what you're seeing is my belly it's transparent yeah it's transparent there's a touch of glitter on the black but to tell you the god's honest truth i didn't even notice the glitter until i was at the beach yesterday and the sun hit it so it's Definitely not like super fancy. The other thing that I really like about it is that it covers a lot of the bust area. This is padded, which is great. The bathing suit has removable pads. The legs are cut a little bit high. On me, they're higher. And I'm going to go over the only criticism that I have of this suit. Now, I, hold on, let me, 
I am just under five six. I have a longer torso than a shorter torso. Had I been any taller, like I'm going to go on record to say, if you are five six plus, this swimsuit may not work for you simply because it's a shorter waisted suit. Luckily for me, boom, I just made the cut. And that's why the leg looks a little higher, um, simply because I just made that cut for the length. Other than that, this bathing suit is perfect. Everything stays where it should be. Now you might notice I do have a little flab over here and you know what? It is what it is. I'm not gonna get worked up over it because this is one great bathing suit. Um, it does help to suck in a lot of the flab if you do have flab. Um, trust me, I am a flabby Mary. So it definitely does suck in a lot. But I also think this is a very flattering one piece for, um, well, not only for all women, but especially the mature woman. I mean, let's face it. How many times have we gone to get swimsuits and we're stuck looking at like these swimsuits that have the ugliest patterns, almost like a tablecloth and have these skirts that like, it's like, what's the deal with the skirts on the bathing suits? Either wear a swimsuit or just wear clothes to the beach. I mean, I, I it, ugh, like that drives me crazy. It's like saying, okay, you're older, so you shouldn't be allowed to show any part of your body at the beach. And that's something that I disagree with because I don't care what your legs look like. I have cottage cheese legs. I have cellulite to go. I mean, if a dairy farmer saw my thighs, he would get excited because they look like cottage cheese. And he would try to take me back to his dairy and suck the fat out of my thighs and make cottage cheese or farmer cheese with it. So I don't care what my legs look like. I don't care if I don't have skinny arms. My thing is I'm going to a beach or a pool and there's a reason that I'm doing that. I want to cool off by swimming or I want to sit in the sun. I want to take my chair down to the ocean, feel the ocean breeze, feel the sea spray and read a book. And I'm not going to be comfortable if I'm not in a swimsuit. So we need, we need to rethink our bodies as we get older. And we need to rethink how we're perceived. Because personally, I don't care what other people think. I only care what I think. And yes, you should, you should be the center of your universe, especially when it comes to how you're going to dress for comfort and ease and to the beach. Now, I am a two-piece bathing suit fan, but I have gained weight. And I, I, this has been the worst year for me as far as not exercising because of my job. I don't have the time to get away from my desk. So I'm a little extra out of shape this year. Wearing a one-piece makes me feel a lot better. And I have to thank my daughter for that. Again, this bathing suit is by the brand Hylor, H-I-L-O-R. They are on Amazon. And I am going to be back with another bathing suit by that brand. Okay, hold on. I will be right back. Okay, guys, I am back. This is the second bathing suit that I purchased from brand Hylor on um, Amazon. Hold on a second. I am going to go. Whoops, let me adjust this. I am going to stand up and show you. Um, now, before I go on, that first bathing suit that I had on, the navy one, I ordered that in a size large. At just under 5'6", my weight 
fluctuates these days between 150 and 155, okay? Not gonna lie, I should be 10 pounds less, but I'm not at this point. Um, that was a large and the fit was beautiful. There was a caveat saying that you should order a size larger because it runs smaller. Now, this is the deep V plunge suit. This I ordered in a size 10. My clothing size is an eight, but I ordered this one in a size 10. Now this bathing suit is more long torso friendly than the other one was. Giving this a fit that's slightly more comfortable. Now, I know a lot of women don't like the deep V. I wear a 36C, so I'm not busty, but they're not pancakes. So I, I guess it's kind of average. And a lot of women that have, you know, that have rather large girls, we're saying on the website that there are, that there is a bit of side boobage. There is, but that doesn't bother me that much. Hold on, I'm gonna stand up so you can get a better look at this suit, okay? Ooh. Whoops. Let me adjust this. Okay, so here we go. Now, I, the weird thing is, I'm not crazy about certain prints because sometimes they have a tendency to look tablecloth-y, but I love this paisley print. And this print really does hide a multitude of sins. So does the ruching. There's ruching throughout the midsection, which I think helps to pull any of the um, blowfish look in a little bit. So here we go. Here's from my right side. Here's from the back. Here's from my left side. And here we go. I like the way that the waist is kind of pulled in a little bit. Um, a lot of other women in reviews were saying that you have to tie the halter really, really tight for support. I found that I don't really need that much support. So the top of this is really super comfortable. Um, again, this was under $30, as was the bathing suit that I previously showed you and the one that I'm going to show you next. I love the ruching. This does have a higher waist. Um, I think this is a very, very forgiving bathing suit. Um, I don't have to worry about anything popping out. If it did, I really don't care. Um, so that's it. I will be back with the next swimsuit. Okay, hold on. Hey guys, here is the third and final bathing suit that I purchased. This is by the brand Be Too Pretty, or is it To Be Pretty? Um, I'll write it down so it doesn't really matter. But now here's the thing where reviews come in so preciously appreciated where the other two suits I had to size up, there was a caveat that this swimsuit was true to size. And um, some of the reviews really attested to that. So I took a chance and I ordered a size um, medium, which is the eight to 10. Um, uh, this swimsuit to me is the best fitting out of all three. I love this tropical print. And if you recall, I think I did a video on a dress that I have with a similar print to this. So hold on, let me adjust before I model this swimsuit. Um, the dress 
that I purchased also from Amazon had a leafy print like this as well. Um, the leaves weren't as big, but what I thought was great was that you could actually pair that dress with this swimsuit. And if you're going to a beach party or a pool party, oh my God, it's the perfect ensemble. Um, it's crazy. But what I like about this bathing suit, actually what I like about all of them, they all have removable pads. All three bathing suits are aligned. All three bathing suits have sturdy fabric. I'm not talking like flimsy five buck fabric, no. All of them are really sturdily built, which I think is great when, um, let's face it, when you're of the mature woman set, you don't wanna have to keep checking for um, any see-through ability from a bathing suit. Like there's no way, these suits are totally opaque, except for the first one where the mesh, there's mesh at the waist. That's the only, that's the only one. But like they're all built like brick, shit houses so to speak these are strong swimsuits and they are worth every single penny all three were under thirty dollars so basically for the price of three swimsuits i mean i got three swimsuits for the price of what major department stores charge for one swimsuit and they even charge more money for one swimsuit um this has removable pads, I'm fine with that. And you can adjust this halter top to kind of make the top go a little bit more revealing or a little bit more modest, depending on your taste. So hold on and I am gonna get up. I'm glad my bones are still working that I can get up like this. Okay, so hold on, let me adjust this. Here we go. Here's the third bathing suit. Again, there's ruching, which hides a multitude of sins and flabbiness. Here's the back. Here's the other side. And as I said, this is a size or rather medium eight to 10, and it, it fits beautifully. So that's it. I'm gonna put the link to my Amazon store. I'm gonna put the names of the brands of each of these swimsuits. Um, and, you know, I just wanna say, wear a bathing suit to the beach. Don't be ashamed of the way that your body is. I mean, my body's not perfect and I don't attest to make it perfect. If I did, I'd be at the gym working out regardless. I would make the time to work out. But there's other important things in life. I want to read a good book. I want to travel. Um, I have a job that I have to sit all day and it helps to pay the mortgage. What can I say? I got to be realistic about this. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed um, this video. All of these bathing suits are mature woman friendly. And, you know, I really did not think that I would be able, hold on a second. I didn't think that I would be able to find a decent one piece bathing suit without having it look super frumpy. But, you know, I'm really, I'm really glad. And it's thanks to my daughter that I found these bathing suits on Amazon. Um, I'm headed outside to read. It's really a beautiful day. It's supposed to hit 90 today. Um, my husband's playing tennis right now, so he'll be gone most of the morning. And um, I'm going to go out, put some sunscreen on, and enjoy some sun time with Chippy. So you guys have a great day. Have a great Memorial Day weekend, whether you're at a cookout 
whether you're home, whether you're traveling, be safe, have fun. And I want to thank every single troop that has ever gone on to protect us. That's it. Take care. Bye.